Hi, welcome to Ever Mentor YouTube channel. So, in this video, we are going to see the most important and the most awaited uh, topic to uh, maximum number of candidates all over the India who are looking for the assistant professor vacancies or the positions in the state or the central government universities. Okay. So, as per the UGC regulations 2018, the ex-UGC chairman uh, mentioned that uh, from 2023 onwards, PhD will be mandatory for the assistant professor qualification also in order to improve the quality in the education. That was a point mentioned by the UGC ex-chairman in 2018. And after coming the new chairman, uh, Professor M. Jagadish Kumar, so he kept that uh, regulation in hold okay, uh, that we will see in the later clarifications and all. So now recently, two days back, uh, UGC new chairman that was existed uh, chairman Professor Jagdish Kumar stated that UGC net is enough for the assistant professor qualification PhD will not be mandatory and these regulations are going to come into official website and officially soon with all the points and very much clear clarity rules and regulations okay so regarding this one whatever the statements done by the UGC chairman that we are going to see in this uh, video and before going into the main content of this video, if you are preparing, you or your friends are preparing for the UGC at Electronic Science June 2023 cycle, then the, the new course or else the complete course started uh, for the Electronic Science uh, UGC net examination. So you can register for this course by downloading the app that is UGC net 88. This app you will get in the Google Play Store or else this app link I kept in the description box of this video. So from that link also you can download. And if you are having any queries regarding this uh, complete course of electronic science, then you may WhatsApp to this provide contact number. And now while coming to the present content of the video, so here in one of the article they mentioned that PhD not mandatory, head qualification is sufficient for the assistant professor post by the UGC. And it is not the old post guys, it is the recent post only that is on March 13th, 2023. Okay, so it is really a very big exclamatory and happy, happy news to all the net qualified uh, candidates okay and if you go to the details regarding this article you may check down PhD net not mandatory net qualification sufficient for the assistant professor post so according to the Telangana today M Jagdish Kumar the UGC chairperson announced at the inauguration of the newly constructed UGC HRDC building on the Usmania University campus that a PhD is not necessary for the recruitment to the post of assistant professor in central universities and Kumar stated that a qualification in the Commission's national eligibility test will be sufficient. This decision aims to allow the professionals without PhD to be appointed as an assistant professor in universities throughout India and provide opportunities to experts who desire to teach but lack a PhD degree. That means so many professionals and industrial persons are working with very good practical knowledge all over the India or else outside the India. Those candidates might not be having the PhD degree, right? So on the basis of PhD degree, Okay, they are not going to stop the expertise in the university. So that's why uh, Professor Jagdish Kumar removed this mandatory of uh, PhD qualification uh, for the assistant professor position in the universities. Okay, so Kumar also mentioned that a one nation one data portal is being developed to provide all UGC guidelines and other uh, crucial information to the candidates. Kumar added that quality education will be extended directly to the students via the National Digital University beginning from the next academic year onwards. And while coming to the Twitter done by the UGC, PhD not mandatory for assistant professor post in a university, so said by the UGC chairman. And uh, yeah, so these are all the details. Okay, and I mean this statement done by the UGC chairman at the inauguration of uh, the new block in the Usmania University campus. So previously the central government had amended the commission's regulation that made the PhD is the minimum uh, eligibility criteria for hiring the assistant professor. The new guidelines were to be implemented in 2021. But again this was postponed due to the COVID-19 pandemic situation and the reports were said that we are going to implement this thing from to to 2023 onwards. So now in 2023 they mentioned that PhD is not going to be mandatory and the uh, official uh, reports, notifications, regulations, each and everything will be published in the UGC website officially in the soon. Okay, you are going to see the official draft rules and regulations soon in the uh, official website of the UGC also. Okay, so these are all the statements done by the uh, Mohamedal Jagdish Kumar and uh, somehow I cannot say that it is a 
very good news to the net qualified candidates okay why because they will give i mean uh, they will give the significance to the expert candidates that means uh, if i mean if any for one assistant professor position uh, two candidates applied one candidate is the uh, pg plus ug net plus 15 years of experience teaching experience Second candidate is having the only post graduation and UG Senate and uh, five years of industrial experience. Then the industrial experience candidate will be given more preference comparing with the uh, teaching experience fellow. Okay, so this type of implementation is going to be happen uh, soon. Okay, so in one point of view, uh, it will not be the uh, very much good news to the. Uh, you know only net qualified candidates but in case if you are applying for any universities with uh, pg plus net only in case the industrial experts are not attending to that uh, interview then the net qualified candidates will be benefited okay so but as per the api point of view that means academic point index as per the api score point of view phd candidates will be 23 marks ahead comparing with the net qualified candidates so i don't know how far this uh, statement given by the m jagdish kumar will be helpful to the net qualified candidate so we have to wait and see okay okay guys fine so please share this video if any information i am getting then definitely i will upload in my youtube channel so if you want to get the regular notifications then subscribe the channel and then tap the bell icon thank you very much for watching the video bye guys